Average speed of moving car can be determined by using the equation below where average speed equals distance traveled divided by time. Which car traveled an average speed of 20 kilometers per hour? Well, if we look at these, I like to find nice even points to do the calculation where this makes a nice intersection here. Uh, car B's got a nice intersection here. Car C's got two nice intersections. Let's use this one here at two just to be different. And car D, that's a nice little intersection there. It just makes the math much easier if you do that. And you say, all right, um, speed equals distance divided by time. It's like miles per hour, all right? That's a speed, right? Miles is the distance, hours, how long it took you to go that distance. Up here, we're using kilometers per hour. That's the same principle. Where right here, we say, okay, we went 30 miles over three hours. And so if you plug those in there, 30 divided by three, that's going to be 10 kilometers per hour. I said miles a minute ago, I meant to say kilometers. 10 kilometers per hour, because 30 kilometers, and if you did that in three hours, that's 10 kilometers per hour. That's 10 kilometers the first hour, 10 kilometers the second hour, 10 kilometers the third hour, add them up, there's your uh, 30 kilometers in three hours. Car B did uh, 60 kilometers in three hours. And so if you plug it into the equation, we did 60 kilometers, we did that in three hours. If you divide, that's gonna be equal to, hey, there we go right there, there's our, our 20. 60 divided by 3 is 20. There's 20 kilometers per hour. And that's the one we're looking for right there. So, again, just to reiterate, at 20 kilometers per hour, over 3 hours, we go 20 kilometers the first hour, 20 kilometers the second hour, 20 kilometers the third hour. That's 60 kilometers, and that's in 3 hours.